Okay, hello. I'm making some short videos for once. This uh, um, video is about using a match function but taking things from a different sheet. So we're going to try to do the same thing. Now, if we use the classic kind of method, first thing is we got to get we need the, the name of the sheet. Now, I, didn't, I wrote this function already, but it's such an a easy one. I can tell you it's called, um, uh, uh, called uh, cell.parrot.name. And I just found it on the internet. Okay, and you can make a little function that says sheet name. And you can go to a different sheet name like this and read in the cell and then once you read in the cell you put cell.parent.name and it spits out the uh, uh, it, it spits out the sheet name so let's do this so let's put sheet name okay and we put equal sheet name Sometimes, you know, and then you just go to this one and click any cell, it doesn't matter, and it gives you the sheet name. Okay, and now if we would like to find the, uh, 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 we would like to find the number of this, this thing, we can put match uh, with indirect. So what I, uh, what I do here is put equal match, okay, and then we take our normal uh, uh, lookup value. This time you can click on the entire column C and put comma zero to get an exact match. And why? Oh, it didn't. We let's put. Uh, Okay, we didn't find one. So there there we get the, the 15, okay? Now, uh, <sighs> okay, uh, but instead of, why did I put, why does this say column test? Just a minute. I, I thought column test. Oh, we, I must have named this column. Hang on. Control th Control F three. Let's delete this column. So sorry about that, but so let's uh, finish this this exercise with the indirect okay and then put comma zero now what you might want to do is take this from a whole bunch of different sheets so instead of data like this you can put indirect and then get the data and then put a double inverted qu comma on this and, oops, and what did I do wrong? I didn't put the uh, uh, parentheses in the right place, but that's that's how we do the match with the ind indirect test. So, so, I used to always do this uh, formula text by hand, but, okay, I think, it, I guess it was worth the, worth it. Now we could also put uh, this this match in in same sheet, but you know what I did is I kind of cheated. I called this match with a different sheet. It's exactly the same function, except uh, I don't have it truncated. So it's just exactly the same thing, uh, but it goes. 
to a different sheet. So it does nothing else but find this. Now this is what is amazing to me that this works. When I see this range and cells, I think that's not going to work in a function, but it does. That's the big deal. That's the big deal. In fact, I said I should put, you know, in this one we almost should put uh, this works in function. We might want to put, you know, use use full recalculate. And make button. Okay, when we when we do those kind of things. Now here's one. It's just got everything the same. So we read in the the lookup value, and we read in the column range. But this time, the column range we're just going to define along with the sheet name. And don't tell me why, but it does work. And so this. Range can be defined with uh, a different sheet. Okay, that's the, the big innovation here. Nothing different in the programming. So we go around the rows, we compare the test uh, uh, value, which is just a whole bunch of different st things in the range with the lookup value. When we find a exact a match, we uh, remember the row and get out of the function. So let's try this. So match with uh, user defined function. So what we do here, we can do it two ways. <laughs> we can put uh, match match in different sheet. Okay. And then we press Shift F3, which didn't work. Okay. Match with different sheet. And we put in the lookup value. And for this, you, we would have to put in, if we did this by hand, we'd have to put data and a, a semicolon and C colon C. Like this. And then it gives us the answer. And as before, if we press control space, shift space by rather, and minus, Kind of interesting that that. Uh, why why did I not have to press the calculate button? Uh huh. This. Uh oh. Oh, I must have uh, deleted. Oh god. Uh, maybe we should uh, go to a one. But we. We'd have to do this again for some reason. So I think we should copy this uh, calculate full to here. Now, so let's, let's try this again. Why? Why it's sometimes. Notice now it's not calculating. Okay. Why, why it uh, suddenly calculates now? I don't know. Okay. And notice, I, I, I guess when I calculated it for one sheet, it calculates it for all the sheets. Okay, now um, we could also put uh, over here, so let's put formula text. Okay, and uh, get this one. But we could also put uh, column. Sheet, and we put uh, this 
and then we put kind. It's kind of almost like the indirect. We put a column C colon C like this. Now, of course, we could also uh, uh, do the the other thing. So now match with uh, column. And we put equal match with different sheet. I really do have too many match functions in here. And we put this thing, and it gives us. Um, okay, for some reason that worked. <laughs> this worked here, and it didn't work here. And. Now, why that happened? What? Did you notice I got the value? Just a minute. Just a minute. I got to figure out what's going on here. Okay. Now, if anybody can answer this next question, I'll be thrilled. But here's what happens. If I just change this, I get a value. Now, if I press this, it fixes it. Let's insert a couple of lines here. And if I would just press F2 on a blank cell, it also works. Can anybody explain this? I don't know. So what I... Uh, adjusted was our calculate full uh, 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 thing and uh, I went to some name that hopefully would have never been used and just made it a blank formula now then I had to put the current res address this is like current sheet equal active sheet dot name current book equals active workbook dot name address equals not active cell dot name but dot address and then you can go back to that when you're all finished so if I put it here and press calculate full it just works now why that works I would love to know I would love to have the answer to that okay so I'm going to uh, stop this video, and this is our video, what did we want to call this? This is our video on, on uh, 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 getting that matching from another sheet, how's that?